Reeve it, my friends! Sasha here! Welcome back to IFSCL Story Mode. We are going to be redoing Chapter 1 because they've made a lot of changes to both it and the game as a whole, such as this main menu music. So, back to Chapter 1. Also, Chapter 0 not available yet. Three now available yet, obviously. Here we go. Yeah, we watched the series. Potential notes, yada yada. Yep. And yes, watch the intro. Maybe something's changed. This is actually my second take because um RTX voice broke, so I'm having to record this directly, kind of like what I'm doing for Exapunked. Oh well, I mean, I can just remove the noise later. Anyway, things look a little cleaner. The font text has definitely changed. But overall, it looks to be about the about the same layout in the scenes. I think that soundtrack credit wasn't there before. Maybe it was, maybe it wasn't, I don't remember. Here we go! Dark and stormy night. All good stories start with a dark and stormy night. So one of the main changes was improvement of the tutorial text, little button thing on screen. Yep, tutorials. Alright, what we got? Yeah, that's changed a little bit too. Area Jeremy Belpois, Thursday, October 9th, 2003. A few weeks ago, I was hunting for parts to finish my miniature robots. Couldn't find anything here I could use, so I had to go look for scraps in the abandoned factory not far from the academy. Figured that I could find plenty of cool mechanical stuff left inside that would be useful. Wasn't disappointed, it was unbelievable. Stumbled onto some sort of complex with the entire computer lab, scares, and especially this totally intense mainframe. For the moment, I haven't told anyone. It's my little secret. It's the coolest thing that's ever happened to me. That wasn't all. That night, even though I was scared stiff, I decided to start up the supercomputer. It's the best decision I've ever made. Another good decision would be getting more sleep. Thought I saw someone in front of me on the bridge. Don't know who. I really hope nobody saw me leaving the park. A few hours earlier. Don't need to sleep right now. <laughs> yep. 
Yep, there's the run button. Camera's kind of wonky, or maybe that's just the way he controls. Hmm? Where are you doing here? Sissy used up all the hot water on our floor. Came to see if you had a hot water on the boys' floor. And you, where are you doing? Are you going out? We're next to free hour, so the privileges of fifth grade student girls. Free hour, and yet you're not on your computer? That's strange. I'd say you're hiding something. Careful, Molly, we're very close to scoop. Why would there be a different hot water here for each of the floors, though? And yep, that background music's definitely changed. Ah, Jeremy. Still running around looking for robot parts? Heh, <laughs> how do you know? I know everything, Jeremy. My eyes are everywhere. Anyway, I'm happy to see you going outside instead of staying in your room behind a screen. I'll let you out for half an hour and be back in the dorms by then. Jim gone Jim. Hey, Miss Hearts. Clear sky tonight. Make sure you view the constellations. Oh! Jeremy, have you heard the news? There's a new guy moving into Ulrich's bedroom. What? What are you talking about? You don't know, but the principal told us this morning. He said at soccer practice, right before our warm-up. It's not important, and since when can a new guy show up a month after the beginning of the school year? Don't know, dude, but you have a double bedroom. This was unavoidable. Nah, I'm sure you're joking. Let's go this way. Ah. Okay, I think that just loops around. Yeah, I see it. It loops around. Hey. What's your problem? Do you want to fight? No, no, I'm just surprised to see you alone. Isn't Herb around? He's usually not far from you. It's none of your business. Herb made me swear not to tell you he's called to the principal's office. And I always keep my word. Dot, dot, dot. Ah, oh, silly Nicholas. You're being watched. It's Jim. Probably. Nothing to worry about. It's probably a student who's trying to sneak out like me. Meanwhile, on the bridge... Huh? Intense standing stare off. Uh was that? I I should really get some sleep. So should we all, Jeremy. So should we all. What if I run to the left? Nothing to do there. Darn. Button! Watch it. And... Supercomputer level. Uh, okay, that's weird. Okay. Button! Uh... 
All right. Let's hope we don't regret this, uh, Matt. Okay, this is definitely new. I should be able to use their face in the laboratory. Yeah, there is definitely something weird about the doors here. Like, this right here, this is the wall I came into and out of. So weird. And there it is. All right. You know, you'd think you'd put better security on this thing. Just anyone can turn it on and create a user account. It's probably something in this list of native programs. Yeah, Xana Earthlink at the bomb. I wonder what else was in there. I'll have to slow that down later. Oh, hey. Okay. Whoa. What's all this? A video game? Who are you? Where am I? Did you hear what I just said? Oh, yes, of course. I see you too. Whoa. Well then, dear artificial intelligence, I guess we're going to have a few things to talk about. That's probably audio from the actual show, it sounds like. Okay, what's your name? I don't know. Do you have a backup? Don't think I can. More like you? Not really. Do you have a version number? Not that I can think of. Creation date? Monday, June 6, 1994. At 6 p.m. Okay, so nine years ago. That's only incredibly precise. At least I know something. You connected to the internet? The data tower I'm in, yes. So much to learn. Are you talking to me? My worlds have an interface just like you. Face appeared in front of me. In front of me. There's definitely typos still in here. Just like me. What's your purpose? I guess protecting this place. Some kind of intelligent firewall? It's a firewall. Wait, now I know. Didn't a few seconds ago, and now I know. So you can learn new things. Amazing! By my role here, I have some privileges. Like administrator rights? Yes, and not on your interface, but in the virtual world. We you know about the scanners. Think they can transfer someone, feel the connections through the cables. They lead to my world. Do you think you could transfer yourself? And appear in the scanners as a real person? No. There's something missing. A body? Yeah, I don't remember ever having one. Are you sleeping all along? Sleeping? I, I guess yes. You're worse than my mother's cat. Your what what? Mother, cat, do you know who's your developer? The person that created you? Nothing. I think I created myself. That's really strange. Where exactly are you? In a virtual world on the other side. Whereas you suppose you're real. You're in the real world, right? Yeah, but you're real too. You sound human. Really? That's... I like that idea. See you later. See you soon. 
Remote super computer. Okay. Whoop, I uh, just turned my head too far around. Off we go. Ah, it's super late. Jim's gonna kill me if he finds me. Ba -da 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 -da. Ba -da 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 -da. Yeah, this music's definitely new. Warwick bedroom. Nicholas and Herb bedroom. Jeremy bedroom. Alright. Turn that on. And let's put this in. Okay. Stalling program. Yeah, I can go to sleep. Okay. Still raining. Eh oh, I see Z fighting. Nothing to say. Rude. Hey Jeremy, have you watched it? What? Watched what now? The movie. We're doing a poll. Everyone seems to say everyone seems to say says it's the best of the saga so far. Which movie? You already do live in a cave, you know? Ah, no, I got it. The movie with the wizards in a school? Of course. Oh, that means you didn't watch it. What a shame. Sorry, girls. I prefer more realistic movies. What do you want? You want to fight? Go away. Rude. Nothing to do there. Okay. Einstein, you're a genius. You return to the past. It works. What's that? Eh? What are you talking about? Don't you remember anything? You no, know, the disco ball and the spaghetti cables that attacked us. The disco ball? Yeah, and Loco and the supercomputer. You know all about Loco? But that's weird. It looks like the return time didn't quite work on him. Good day. I should ask Alia for some advice. Okay, that would be... Loco connect... Dot vcom... Hi! So, you don't remember Zan's attack at all? Not really. That return to the past is very effective. Guess you have to scan yourself in Loco to keep your memory intact. Yeah, I'm planning on doing that tomorrow night. First, I need to work on your materialization program. You're certain? Well, if you need help, don't hesitate to ask me. Oh, thanks. Vince Herb to give me a programming book. Okay, this part is definitely new. Or an odd bedroom. It's an herb bedroom. There you go. Please, Herb, I really need this book. No way, I brought it for the next two months. First come, first serve. Why is it so important all of a sudden? That's... Eh. Always hiding secrets. You haven't changed. Leave me alone or I'll keep it even longer. So, Herb, are we going to be hard-headed about this? Stay out of it, Starn. Or what, you'll call Nicholas? That's right. Well, go on then. I'm sure we'll be happy you woke him up for a book. I... Next time I'll complain to Miss Morales. Code editing rules. Okay, that is definitely new. Did 
Didn't realize that the scan took this long. Why isn't he also virtualizing himself, like, to talk with Hylita? I don't know. Maybe it's hard for him. He has a crush on her, but he prefers distance. Oh, good. If you have a crush, you go and talk to her and voila! Yeah, sure. Okay, that's a little different. The glasses were glowing last time. So, how was it? First staying in the laboratory armchair. Just like math classes for me, I'd rather stay in bed than attend them. Going upstairs to work on Aaliyah's materialization program. How what? How that, that type hasn't been fixed. So you don't give up that easily. Hey guys, Leia told me she have help pulsations on Laoko. She thinks it's Xana. Speak of the devil. I'll go to the lab to chance for you. I'm gonna lure it out. Odd, wait! More tutorialing. Okay, let's wake up Yumi. Virtualize me whenever you want. Let's take the ladder. Okay, leave a virtual map. Oh, there's the hollow map. I should go do something first. Elevator. Elevator close. Elevator, I give three. And the door opened on its own. Okay. Elevator, close again. And elevator, off. Oh, available doors are opened. Now do it. There we go. For safety. V-map. V-map, Ailita. Forest sector. Tower is now activated, shouldn't be far from Ilya. So, do you mean an Auric Discord are there? Okay. Let's see. Yeah, right over there. Tower 9, and going to Tower 5. Here goes. Transfer, human. Transfer, Ulrich. And yeah, tab, tab key a shortcut. I need to use that more often. Scanner, Yumi. Scanner, Ulrich. Let's go direct to tight leader. Virtualization. Uh oh, my own time for next assault. All right. Let's see what we got. You get out of the tower, you oops, you follow Ailita, you follow Ailita, and you go to the tower. Usual routine. Yeah, so this part doesn't seem to have changed that much aside from the minimum time before assault window not opening until after they were virtualized. Uh, Elita, you okay there? Hmm. Just as long as there aren't any nav meshing issues that cause them to go into the digital C. Remember having that issue in previous videos? Oh, sure. <laughs> they really need to go faster. Oh, here we go. Power routine set. Dodge.
keep dodging. Yeah, I definitely like the music that's been added. Because it makes it feel a lot... Makes it feel a lot cooler. Why well, that? It saves me a lot of time in editing. Hey, you're overshooting, Eileta. And just one block. Okay. And it's gone. Okay, get in the tower. Up you go. And... Tower deactivated. Now what am I supposed to do again? Oh, diverge them. Materialization Ulrich. Materialization Yumi. I think we shouldn't hesitate. Someone probably saw the sphere or got attacked by it. I don't get why, it re why it would reattack Sissy. It's not as if there was much brain to fry in the first place. I don't like Sissy either, but you never know. Yeah, we should be careful. I'll launch a return to the past. Hope you remember everything this time, Einstein. Can't see myself re-explaining the whole situation to you again. Same as usual. And return to the past now. Meanwhile, in Switzerland, 1978. I think that drawing's improved. I remember if it was even there last time. So, that's the end of that chapter. So, next time we will be going to chapter 2. Till then, do Brinich, Ukraina. Do Brinich.